it was just funny and shout out to all my boys on Xbox because they don't know this, but this is where it came from. Um, like we play 2K and when we play in, like everybody judges everybody's defense and calls it clocking in. <laughs> and it's pretty much like at the end of the game, my teammates are ranking on you like, oh, I see you ain't clock in today, meaning you didn't get a steal at least. Gotcha. And they just kept saying that over and over and over again. And like, I was just like, man, that sounds so dope, like clock in. Because, I mean, I'm J-Work. And then Trey went to a seminar that was hosted by Buster Rhymes. And he took a lot of notes. He came home and was so excited to tell me about everything he learned. And one thing that stuck with me was every, as an artist, every single one of your projects isn't a separate story. They need to be the different chapters of the same story. And I took heed to that. And like with gems, that's why you see, if you see the gold around clocking, mm -hmm. it's the same gold that was around gems. And that gold is going to now stay consistent in all of my projects because I took heed to that. This is all part of the same story. So you're going to get that same book cover, but the inside is just right. going to consist differently. And I mean, shout out to Trey because he killed the artwork. But yeah, clock in is just truly something that I really worked extremely hard on. And then with Kakila Kalam, man, like he really is like the greatest person I've ever worked with as far as like engineer wise, because I can now get a five hour block, like my last five hour block, for instance, I got a five hour block and he stopped me after four and was like, dude, listen to them. <laughs> Cause I had 11 songs done in four hours. Right. And he was like, dude, your voice is starting to crack. You're starting to, you know, relax, listen to what you got. And it's just cause like we work so well together. Like right. he knows everything. Like I don't have to tell him nothing. Like, all right, come on, verse. Are you ready to do your bunch? Yep. You ready to do your atlas? Yep. All right, next one. Boom. Drop the beat. Boom. And just keep going. <laughs> right. And I don't come out. Like everybody else will be in the studio smoking, rolling up, drinking, whatever. But by the time all the weed's gone, all the songs is done. <laughs> like, and I come out and then Jake will hit me with the blunt. Like, all right, here you go. I saved you, boy. <laughs> like, you know, just so I can get some smoke on. Because I don't got to smoke an obscene amount. As long as I can get my little buzz on, I'm straight. Like, right. And like, I'm always about to work. And Clock In really just has come together so well. Just with all the producers that I have in touch with it. And like, I'm just truly grateful for the opportunity right now that is arising. Because now... I've been working so hard to get like a headlining show right and like this is my first one that's on the horizon here coming up on the same day I drop a project that means so much to me and like I'm, I'm truly excited about it and like just meeting all the people I've been networking with as far as like you know like invasion and you know I'm, I'm really working on getting around this city a little bit more and putting my hand on things and people seeing that yo j work is really about this shit right and i really been you know i just did an open mic the other night just because i wanted to be on stage man give a fuck if i win <laughs> i'm just gonna go up there and rap and right. every, i had everyone's attention nice every word you say people looking at me like yo who the fuck is this dude <laughs> like 